Hi. Uh, EGR is out. You don't have to dismantle this panel or this panel. Uh, first thing you do... Hi. So anyway, uh, fuel rail out, PCV valve out. Make sure you disconnect this uh, sensor because it was on the way to take the PCV valve out. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, nine, ten bolts. PCV valve is out. And then um, the EGR valve itself, it's hold on uh, two bolts here and two bolts here. This is going to be out because uh, this is the bracket bolt. When you undo the bracket with the wiring, this bolt is going to be out already. This bolt needs to go out and, and the stud itself needs to go out in order to lift the valve up. Uh, basically one, two, three, four. These bottom bolts, you don't have to undo them completely. It's an Allen key. Was it six millimeters? I think you just loosen them and they stay in the engine. And then here you have to undo the clamp for the exhaust, which looks like this. And then you have left with uh, two hoses, this one here and this one here. Be prepared to be prepared to lose some coolant or catch it as we did the hose, if you look here, I clamped it with the vice grip pliers. Uh, we was meant to replace it with the, as we th think, the good used ones, but now we are going to stick a new one because the other one, used one, I'll show you now, it's uh, no good at, at all as well. It's stuck open. So if you're gonna replace it, don't really don't really think about the used one, buy a new one. Basically, the point of the video, you don't have to uh, dismantle the scuff thing. It's coming out this way. It took me about two hours to undo. Good luck.